mate. Oh. We have a Harley Benton. I think it's serious. With Roswell pickups. Mm hmm. Um, apparently, when they. When. Harley Benton first came out, the first time they bought this out, they didn't have it this colour. But now, they bought out this colour. And. It once set up, it says that's yeah, what it looks like. I'm a bass player, but I want to learn bass. And it looks stunning, man. It, it looks, looks nice. Looks, it really looks nice. And it plays alright. Yeah. You know what I love about this is the the inlays. The inlays, yeah. It's got it's got the ivory binding. Oh yeah, it is ivory binding. And in. the frets are not air, so they're not cut yeah, here or anything. Really there's smooth. There's no sharp edges in there. There's no, no. sharp frets. It's got a total shell pickup, chrome bit there, and it's got the volume. You can see it's still tone. brand new. When do you got this? Out. I got you only this got Monday. This Monday, yeah. I got it Monday. And you got these brass uh, saddles. So brass copper, yeah, so brass, brass saddles. Yeah. Brass saddles with chrome metal bridge, Roswell pickups, free ploy pick guard, um, <laughs> Canadian. Neck also would, yeah, yeah, because of the color. Um, because of the, the color, <laughs> satin, satin neck, really nice. Yeah, I love it. Playability, look yeah, it. yeah, look. looks look at that. It's even got rubber That's on it. the like, when you go at the back, back plate. Look, you've even got a rubber plate, then the chrome plate. Really yeah. nice. It's a nice face. I like it. It's my first. Bass I've ever brought. Uh, brought. Yeah, the brought or bought? Brought and bass. I can play a little bit, not a lot. Enough to pass. But I want, to, I want somebody else to play. I like it. I like the machine heads. They're quite good. Listen to that. So, out of the box, you, you, you didn't the box. set it up? No, out no, of the box, set up. plug in, play. Yeah. It's like a computer, plug in and play. But, um, then you can run and just blow this a little bit. Didn't yeah. you have to trust what? Straight as a die, isn't it, the neck? Mm. We looked at the neck and it's no problem with that. All right, um, for people might ask us how heavy this is. This is uh, a pair heavy. Yeah. Because this is a basswood. I think it's basswood, isn't it? Yeah. Just um, yeah. yeah. It, it is heavy compared yeah. to um, Esquire. Yeah. Yeah, this is heavy. Harley Benton do it again, they've done it again. I just don't know how they do it. I mean, you could, but it's been, I think that, that, you that color has been out for, I don't know, less, I than, don't know how long. less than two years or two mm, years? Probably. But or a year? I don't know. Because yeah, I, I remember when I bought mine, the all natural, I didn't see this, I didn't see this color yet. No. So, yeah. So the base is, um, Running on this um, Merger Utobus BX120 Watt. So. That's my attempt in the slap bases. I'm getting there slowly, but I don't care. I, I'm, I ain't got in no competition with anybody. I'm just going to sit there and plug along. There you go, my. Show them some of your base legs. <laughs> Yes. Seven out, of, seven out of ten. Hmm. It's not a ten because then we'll be talking about fenders. <laughs> no, it's not. Definitely but not ten. For a beginner, or um, you know, a, a, even a professional could get away with it. You know, let, let's hear prop some riffs from a man who plays bass, shall we? Because <sighs> um, I don't play bass. Yeah, I'm a bassist, but. Uh, but But you've got the mother pole in lace, but they're not proper mother of pole. But they look like, you know, imitation mother of pearl. What's it feel like to you? Well, you seem to be enjoying it. Look at the 
Baisa, which is, you already say that. Really nice. Yeah, so this will open, let's close it up. Yeah. What's that, what sort of riffs would you do with that song? What slang, what song would you do with that sound? Is that a funk sound or a really yeah. deep? Yeah, because this is a copy of uh, uh, jazz. Jazz bass. Jazz, Fender jazz bass uh, that came from 1970s, the mm. 70s jazz bass, mm. especially the inlays. Yeah. Uh, yeah, the tortoise, whatever. It sounds, looks, looks, looks uh, 70s. Mm. So basically more on I like the 70s slapping though. funk disco. Well, you can play any any genres if you want to be honest. Right. This is the uh Yeah, this is the bridge pickup. <laughs> Now you're only playing the middle, aren't you? No, there's a, there's a bridge pick up. You switch that off then, yeah? This one. Okay. Yeah, this one is the neck pick up. You can hear the... Yeah. I like that. This is just the neck pickup. And then let's turn this on. How would you set it if you wanted to play it all the time? Would you put both pickups on or just one? I mean, the price is quite silly. 400. 160, 150? 150 quid 140 with shipping. Whatever is that plus the shipping. Well, yeah. yeah, this is well worth it. For the price, man. Mm. The Roswell price, pickups really are really worth. good. Didn't think they were, but they pickups, are. Pickups, you know, decent, really good, you know, good sounding pickups. Mm. Yeah. Cool. And, and, and it looks stunning. Look at the color. Yeah, it Look looks nice, doesn't it? The inlays, the, you know, the neck, and the breadth. Yeah, you know, there's no sharp. How do they do the there. finish like that? God really nice. dear. Really I good. like it. Yeah, I love, I love this. I love this. Mm. Yeah, it sounds awesome. Sounds good. Okay, you, cool. You can't, you can't compare this to a Pender because no. Pender is Pender, you know. Yeah, you're talking Some, a thousand pound guitar plus. Yeah. Even for a Pender mm. player, this is plus. And I, I don't know how to compare it. Uh, the sounds, sounds sounds good. Yeah. But it's not like Pender. No, no. Plus, you know, it's heavy. Yeah, heavy. Mm. If you're thinking about getting this for gigging, I think you can get away with two songs, mm. three songs, <laughs> and then, nah, yeah. You, you can use this as a backup, you know, mm. backup bass, in case uh, you But for a learner and an intermediate, yeah. it's, uh, it's well, a, definitely you can gig this yeah. bass. Definitely you can gig this bass. Yeah. So cool. I think this is the bass that you're going to. Take it to your gigs, play with it, and then if someone, someone stole or steal you, you know, someone make this, you're not gonna be crying because you know the price is not that, like tenders or something. You know what I mean? Yeah, I know exactly what you yeah. mean. Yeah. So yeah, it's just one you that that's heavy. Mm. Yeah, it's really heavy. It's heavy, yeah. yeah. But if you sit down with but it, if you're sitting, you're not gonna, mm. you know, you're not gonna think about, you know, the weight of this bass. Yeah. Cool. So this is my mate's bass guitar, anyway. So it's not Thank mine. you. Anyway. So what do you think about your bass, mate? I love it. I love it, and I can't wait to learn more on it. I'm yeah. really happy with it. Apart from it being heavy, but I'm really happy with it. Harley Benton done it again. Yeah. And I don't. You know, people out there say, ah, oh, Harley Benton, cheap, cheap, cheap. I don't care. Harley Benton are good, mate. And they do their job, and that's what you want. Yeah, we're not going to buy it if it's shit. No, yeah, sorry for no. our language, my language. We don't, well, we don't. No, we don't. it's good. It's a good what, brand. It's playable. You know, that's not going to hurt her hands a lot. 
and it's not gonna hurt your you know your wallet your no. bank account whatever. Mm -hmm. so anyway mm -hmm. peace out